they should have. The Honourable Member for Calgary Centre. Well, thank you, Madam Chairman. And I want to thank my colleague for his comments. There were a few things in his speech that I would question him on. He talked about war profiteering in Canada on resources and on the taxes that our natural resource industries pay. $30 billion more in taxes they've paid over the last six months than they have in the previous year. Uh, yes, there has been a rise in commodities across the board. However, in Canada, let's acknowledge that our price for oil and gas, $30 less than it is in the U.S. for oil. And at times this summer, our natural gas price was actually negative. So he's right in some respects when he says that the free market is failing Canadians because there isn't a free market because this government has held up all kinds of infrastructure, no doubt, which is some of the things we should be focus focusing on. But I do want to focus on one thing he talked about because he talked about the carbon tax. And he said Ottawa shouldn't have control over this part of the economy, something I completely agree with him on. Would he suggest and would he say that, number one, Alberta was the first province in Canada to have an industrial cost on carbon over 20 years ago, and he's suggesting that maybe this should be the way it is. Would he side with the Conservative Party here in saying, get the federal government out of its ridiculous carbon tax regime, which isn't working? The Honourable Member for Cowie St. Malahart, Lankford. Well, <coughs> what I, I, and let me clarify my remarks, because, because I think my Honourable colleague misinterpreted what I meant. What I meant was that in, in British Columbia, we are happy that our provincial government actually took leadership. In fact, they were the first province to go down this road. And actually, it was a conservative government. I mean, they call themselves BC Liberals, but they were the ones that brought in the price. And, and by the way, do we all remember the name Preston Manning when he used to advocate for a carbon tax? Uh, yeah, I remember that. That's good. But ultimately, what I meant is that it, it's good that a provincial capital in BC took the reins because it allows us to have a little bit more flexibility over how we distribute that income and help our local citizens in need. <coughs>